Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we have the new Diatone and this is the Diatone Hyperlight version or a light version we might say and I actually picked up two. I got the True X because I hate Stretch X. I don't hate Stretch X, I just don't like how it flies. It's probably good just for racing, but for freestyle and just having fun, I find Stretch X to be the best, I mean the <laughs> True X to be the best all around for me. Now I picked up two of them. I picked up the six inch and the seven inch version, and this is the seven inch version. So I just wanted to quickly show you before I put it together how it comes. These are vacuum sealed, it's pretty insane. So it's just crazy, look all the hardware are in there. It's just awesome, let's just see how satisfying this is gonna be, hopefully it's very satisfying. <laughs> that wasn't satisfying at all. Oh no, there we go. No, it wasn't that satisfying. All right, I'm just gonna skip over the build process. Let's just take a look here. These are some weird strap, very weird. So we'll see what's up with these. We get two of these. Uh, we get a bunch of zip ties. We get how many zip ties? We get four zip ties. We get four or five blue nuts. And we get five smaller screws and just a bunch of other hardware. So I'm gonna go ahead and we do get an anti-slip battery pad. I think this is gonna be very useful. And we have some of these. We'll figure out what these are for in a bit. All right, so let me put this together and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so he is put together and it's, this thing's insane. It's a seven inch quadcopter. That is just, it's huge. You guys have no idea. So what I'm gonna do probably with this is a 6S low KV F60 motor or something, or an F40 motor, which will be pretty insane and pretty light as well. Now, what's so cool about Diatone here is they actually provide you an extra piece for you could possibly even build another frame with the extra hardware they give you so they give you an extra blue nut just in case you lose one they give you two of these camera uh, plastic thingies that hold the camera in place so you have two sets so here's one set and then the other sets inside two battery straps and everything you need to build it and it's just it's pretty awesome so it takes a 30 by 30.5 by 30.5 flight controllers it also takes 20 by 20 which is pretty awesome and you know this I'm gonna stick at 30.5 by 30.5 because I'm gonna be using uh, some massive uh, voltage in it because I just want good ESCs to be on board so overall this thing is just um, it's crazy it's really crazy so let's just get some of its measurements real quick because I haven't even done that so let's just go ahead and see the top plate now the top plate is 2.06 millimeters, 2 millimeters, bottom plate is 3 millimeters, and the arms are 6, 6.5 millimeters are the arms, and they are chamfered down, let's just get the width, uh, 9, well, 10 millimeters, yeah, we'll just say 10 millimeters in width here, so overall, I mean, it looks nice, uh, it obviously does have some flex, and the flex is on the body here, it's a 7 inch, so, uh, I think if you crash this, you will break it. It's just, you know, it's obvious. Um, I w maybe if there was three, uh, if the arms were held together with three s screws somehow, they'd probably been a little bit stiffer. But yeah, this is a seven inch, don't expect much. So I really am very excited for this one. So this can obviously be a top and bottom mount battery. And it's, I think I would say inspired maybe by the Hyperlite Floss. And um, it's very nice to see this. I really do like this actually. So I'm gonna see how this is gonna turn out. And uh, I'm going to build it and see how well it does. Because it's very good. You know, the price is also very good. It's not charging you like a trillion for it. So I'm very happy in that perspective. And like I said, I got the True X version. So this is going to be pretty interesting and pretty fun as well. So that's going to conclude it for this video, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys have any questions or any suggestions, feel free to let me know. And please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It really helps the channel. And... I will see you next time. See you guys. Take care.